Hello, my name is Krista. Today I will put one more the primitive function. I have written this one before, but there are a lot of writing, so they are taking a lot of time to write, so I decided to do that before. So I did that, so now I will do the uh, I, do, I will find the primitive function of this equation here. And this is one divided by x power three, a parenthesis x plus one, and all this uh, power two. So now here I'm doing the partial fraction, which means the first one is the a divided by x plus b divided by x power two, plus c divided by x power three. You see that I have a taken here in the denominator first x, x power 2 and x power 3. Now it's finished for them. Now I have a two times to use this one here, which one is the x plus 1. I mean in that case d divided by x plus 1 plus a divided by x plus 1 power 2. Okay, so now uh, the lowest common denominator for all this one here is this I'm just writing here. So now I say like this, the first one here, a divided by x, they don't have a, a x power 2. I putting this one here and this one here, which means that x power 2 multiplied by x plus 2, x plus 1, power two. The second one, I have this one here, b divided by x power two. And uh, these don't have a, they have a uh, just x power two, but here I have a x power three, which means I need one x just. And this equation, even this then don't have a, this one here. Okay, so I'm putting one even here, okay. So now I have a uh, c divided by x power three. I have this one here, but I don't have a this one. So I'm putting this one here, which is means this one, okay? And d divided by x plus one, x plus one. d divided by x plus one, they don't have a this one here, and this one here, but divided by, by one, so it will be just one, this one here. And a divided by x plus one power two, they have this one, but they don't have just this one. So which means I multiplied a multiplied by x power three. Okay? I hope you understand this one here. Okay, so now I will expand this one here, which is the quadrat quadratic equation. And you know the quadratic equ equation is the same like the first one power two plus two, the first one multiplied by the second one, uh, and plus the second one power two, which is one power uh, two is the one. So I don't write in this one. Even, even is the same for this equation here. I need the, the first one power two plus two x plus one. Okay, so now, even for the third is the same. And uh, the x I'm just writing in this one I'm writing, okay? So now I'm putting everywhere here in these equations, I take the uh, x power to multiply by x uh, power two is the x power four and a coming uh, even. And after that I have a x power two multiply by four x power is the two a x power three and the second one a uh, x power two multiplied by one is the same x uh, power x three for b x is the same i did like here i have a b x power uh, b x multiplied by x power two is the uh, b x power three plus two x b x power two plus bx multiplied by one is the bx 
And after that, we have the same here. I have a C, C uh, multiplied by X power two plus two, C X plus C. And after that, we have a DX power four plus DX power three. And after that, we have a, um, uh, AX support, uh, power three. So, uh, to, to do a little bit uh, uh, easier to understand that I taken uh, the, uh, for example, in that case, I have a a power four and dx power of eight. I have a same coefficient. So I'm putting them here, a plus d, plus d uh, inside parentheses power x, uh, x power four. And after that, I highlight it even this one here, this one here, this one here, and this one here, which means the two A plus B plus D plus A. And uh, in front of the parentheses, I'm putting x power three, okay? I hope that you understand that. So now I have the, this, the second, the magenta line which I mean A plus 2B plus C and outside parentheses I take this X power 2. And after that I have a, a B plus 2C and outside parentheses I'm putting just this X. And uh, finally I have that plus C and divide it with this uh, x uh, x plus one. Okay. So now let me let me do this calculation here that you should understand how I did that. Okay. I am putting here uh, a system of equation. I'm saying first. Um, let me copy this one here to have the same coefficient. I'm sorry for that now. I will do that like this here. And after that, I will take this one here. And I will take this one here. And I will take this one here. Uh, I'm sorry, just see, see, yes. Okay, so let me put, but I'm going out here. Okay, and I'm putting this in here. And we see that um, A plus D, I don't have a, a, a X power four, I don't have a here. And I just, I'm writing that this is equal zero. The second, the second equation, they don't have a two, no X power two. Three, I don't have a, and I put it even there zero because I don't have a here, x power three. Even uh, x power uh, two, I don't have a even x power two here. Even uh, x, I don't have a even x power, just x. And this one is zero, but I have, uh, one which C is the equal one. Okay, so now let me continue to solve this equation here. Uh huh, I'm sorry. So let me copy this on here one time. Control V. So now we'll put wherever where when I have a C, 
I don't like to write two times, you know, C, uh, C multiplied by two, which is one is the two. So here I will put just one and uh, that's it. Okay. So I will put one more time. From here, B, I will take this one in another side here. And you see that uh, in this side was the plus, but here will be minus. And so now we take this minus two and I will put in everywhere when I see B, even here. Okay, so now is the time to solve for A. So now I have a minus two plus one, minus two multiplied by two is the uh, four, minus four plus one is the minus three and minus three in another side here will be just three, okay? Um, yes, also two multiplied by two is the four minus four, Plus one is the minus three, and other side that will be plus plus three. So now I will put instead of two, I will put uh, three, and uh, this minus here will we give it just minus two. Um, so, and uh, A, A was the equal three. Okay. And then now I will copy this one. I will go down. Let me see if I do right. I hope that everything is right. It's very easy to do. Uh, fail. But I hope I don't know. This D is here. This plus three in another side when I'm putting will be minus. Minus three. And I will cancel this one here. And here I have a six, two multiplied by three is the six. Here I have a minus uh, two and I have a minus three here because this is the minus three. Also, let me take one more time. Okay, so uh, six minus five, Two minus three is the minus five, uh, minus five plus six is the just one. And which means that uh, plus one in this side in another side gives just minus one. Let me see now if I have a correct here. Let me put this on, I will change the color. The color is blue one. Let me control now if I did right here. I have a here, A is the three, B is the minus two, uh, C is the one, D is minus three, and A is minus one, which is here. Let me do a little bit better here because it's, uh, and I will close this one too. I will put this equation here. I will put one integral here. So, and 
everything here will should come. Okay. Okay, they are doing some problem. They are doing some problem. I'm sorry for that. Uh, okay. I will put here first integral. After that, I will put the equation. There will be conflict. So, and now I will write the x. Okay, let me go out now. Okay, so now you see here that a, a is 3 divided by x, b is a minus 2 is x power 2, you see here, c is the 1 divided by this one here, a is the minus 1, no, d is minus 3, which is this one here, and uh, a is the minus 1. Let me correct this one. This one is not good. I'm sorry for that. Uh, let me copy this one here. So I will put uh, first here a is equal a is equal uh, a is equal three b. is equal minus 2, c is the 1, and the d is minus 3, and uh, c is 1, a, b, c, d, h, a, is minus one. Let me correct one more time. A is equal three, B is minus two, C is one, D is minus three, A is minus one. Okay. So now it's easy to To see this, so the first one is the three, the second one is the minus two, the third one is the mi one, the, uh, the fourth is the minus three, and the uh, last is the minus one. Okay, so now we have a one integral, and after that, I take in every uh, of this here uh, the own integral, but I'm putting the three, for example, this constant three in the uh, in front of the integral here, 1 divided by x dx minus 2 coming in the front of the integral, 1 divided by x power 3 dx plus 1 divided by x power 3 dx minus 3. And here I have a, this one here. And the last one, this minus goes is front of integral and 1 divided by x, uh, x plus 1 power 2. And now I'm substituting just this one here because this one should give that u is the x plus 1. When I'm uh, taking the derivative of this one is the d u is equal to x, which gives the ln. But uh, let me see now. The first one here is the 3, 1 divided by x gives the ln x 
absolute value of x minus 2. But this uh, x, I'm, when I, I'm taking uh, in the numerator divided by 1 would be the minus 2, the x plus x power 3 coming uh, in the, the numerator and it will be minus 3, the x minus 3. And here coming this substitution here, which is 1, uh, u divide, uh, 1 divided by u. And this one should give you the ln after that. And here we have um, x plus 1. But here I must put 1 minus. OK. So the first one is finished. The second interval gives the x to the first one. The second, we have a x minus 2 plus 1 divided by minus 2 plus 1. Plus, this one gives the x minus 3 plus 1 divided by uh, minus 3 plus uh, minus 3 plus 1. And uh, this one here gives the minus 3 ln u minus x plus 1 uh, power 2 minus 2 plus minus 2 plus 1 divided min minus 2 plus 1 and plus some constant c. c. OK, so now when we did everything, I will substitute back this one here. And uh, this one I don't, I don't need. So I will cancel. I will substitute back this one here. And when I substitute, I receive 3 ln x plus 2 uh, x power minus 1 comes down. OK, and this minus multiply this minus will be minus multiplied by minus gives that plus, which means that you have a 2 divided by x. This x comes down. OK, this minus x power minus 2 coming down, OK? And minus 3 plus 1 is the 2, and this 2 is coming here. But I have a minus here. I, I have a minus here, and this minus coming here. They will change the, the plus, uh, plus multiplied by minus is the minus. And the results will be 1 divided by 2x power 2 minus 3 alone. But now when we substitute them back, I will receive x plus 1. and Finally, here I have a, a minus 2 plus 1, which gives the just minus 1, or will be the same here. Minus 1 multiplied by minus plus, this is the plus. And this uh, x plus 1 uh, power uh, minus 1 comes down and will be x plus 1 power 1, which is x plus 1, and plus, say, constant, c constant. So now this is done. Let me do on our control if I did everything correct. So here I have a, the equation. So I have a geogebra. Remember, it's good to be familiar with geogebra. It's a very good program. I will do a lot of lecture in geogebra. This is like a CAD program, like a TOE5, like Petit-Sacreo parametric. You can do mathematical problem, OK? You can sketch the, the figure, and you can do everything. But you must be familiar with that. OK, let's take now this equation. 1 divided by x. Let me put power 3 here. And after that, I will put this here, x plus 1. Let me go out to enter. OK. So you see here that the geogebra don't show like me. I did. They are shown. Um, I uh, I can do this calculation, but I promise you, 
they will be the same. Uh, so let me ask, let me ask now, let me ask Wolfram Alpha. I skipping to do this calculation. This is a simple algebra. Um, mm -hmm. So what is the Wolfram Alpha now? Then disappear. So here it is. Okay. It's good to have a, this up Wolfram Alpha up. Um, so even here, I will just take here integral. Um, again, integral uh, one divided by uh, x power three parentheses again and uh, x plus one and I will put even here power two I will put one brackets here the x let me okay and enter both of them should uh, say the same like me So, so you see what Wolfram is saying here. Uh, Wolfram saying the same like me. The first one I have a minus two x power two. Uh huh. Is something wrong? I don't know. Okay, just a minute. Let me call that. Uh, yeah, here is that minus one divided by the first, this one here is this one. Two divided by x is this one here. And one x plus one is this one here. Plus three uh, log x, which is the same that three ln x minus three ln x plus one and plus some constant c okay but now because GeoGebra writing like this let me take do this calculation here i will this i will do this calculation let me copy this one here I will put here. So, okay. Now I will delete this one here. So, I will delete even this one here, minus three L and X. And I will delete this one here. Okay. So, now I have a here, I should find, I should find here the, I should find here the lowest common denominator for x, 2x power two plus x plus one. Let me do that here. I will write x, I will write two, uh, x power two, um, and I will write x plus one. Okay, which case the first one x, and I'm saying x divided by x here is one. Okay. 
And uh, after that, I have a 2x divided by x is the uh, just 2x, OK? And uh, after that, I have a x plus 1. I cannot divide this one. OK, and I write it here equal. So now I can take the second one here. Let me do a little bit something like this. And I will put this down. So now I'm taking 2x, which gives the first one. And I'm saying uh, 2x divided by 2x is just 1. And after that, I'm writing just this one, x plus 1, OK, which is now I will take this here, x plus 1. And now I'm going down. 1 is the same. 1 is the same. I don't divide this by the 1 because this one is done. 1. And even here, after that, I receive 1. And now it's finished. So I have to multiply this one. The first one is the 2x multiplied by x is the 2 is the 2x power 2. I'm sorry. Power 2 multiplied by x plus 1. OK, so now I'm saying like here. Here I have a 2. The first one is the 2 multiplied by, I have a just one x here. And I will take everything from here. This one, I will take everything. I will put here. But this squared, I will cancel. Because x divided, 2x power 2 divided by x is the just 2x, OK? And for second one, I have a 2x, but I don't have a, this will be minus. I have a 2x power 2, but I don't have a this one here, x plus 1. So I will put x plus 1. And finally, I take this one plus 1. But I don't have a, this one here. I'm putting 2x power 2. So now let us calculate everything. So what happened? So I have a 2 multiplied by 2x is the 4x power 2. I'm taking 2, two multiplied by 2 is the 4. And the x multiplied by x is the power 2. OK? And after that, we have a plus. I'm sorry. So plus 4x. 2 multiplied by 2 is the 4 multiplied by 1 here is the plus 4x, OK? And after that, I have a minus x minus 1. 1 multiplied by x is the minus x, minus x. Minus 1 multiplied by plus 1 is the minus 1. And uh, plus. 2x power x power 2. 
Okay, let me highlight this one here, the same color. Um, this one, blue one, and this one, blue one. And uh, I will take the this one here in the same color. I'll put magenta. And this one I will just copy and put one too. So let me see now if I did uh, right. 4x power 2 plus 2 is the 6x power 2 and uh, 4x minus x is the plus 3x and minus 1. And this one I dividing this by the denominator which is this one. Okay, let me see now. I will put everything black here. Even this calculation here. Black. Let me put one is equal one. Okay, so now let me check. So let me copy this one here. I will put down. So now I will cancel this one here. And this one here. But I will put this one here for K. And uh, this one was the plus or minus. Just a matter. Three is the plus. Okay. Let me check now now what George was saying. Um, okay. So, George was saying 6x power 2 plus 3x minus 1. And George is so smart that are taking uh, 2. <laughs> uh, um, in front of this uh, fraction, it's very, very good done. I think that my solution is much better than this one. It's, it doesn't. It doesn't matter. So now I receive the same like algebra. This is the uh, simple algebra. So I hope that you understand that. But let me let me help you a little bit to to do this one here. Copy one time. Put them there, and after that, take math type here and uh, put this uh, I will put text here control V I'm doing what happened control V okay uh huh something it's wrong. I don't know what what happened. Okay. Latex. Okay. Something is wrong. I don't know what's the problem. Let me see what is the problem. I will delete this two here. To be a scientist, it's not easy, I promise you. Uh, cancel. Uh, 
let me copy one time. Mm, mat type latex. Okay. I will put text here. Okay. I don't know why they don't show the text. I'm sorry for that. Is something wrong? I don't know what's the problem. But okay. Now Georgia are protesting. But okay. I don't know what's the problem. Let me restart the program. Okay. Scientists should never give up. Okay. So now I will put here again integrals and I'm writing one divided by um, x power three and I'm putting this one one x plus one um, power three power two um, enter Okay, let me see now if I can put text. I don't know, they don't function, I don't know, maybe, I don't know what's the problem, I'm sorry for that. Maybe I should start the computer again, but, now I should do that here and I will show the name and value. Here is the, this equation, but this is the algebra equation. It's not mine. I don't know why I cannot put my equation. I don't know. Settings. I don't know why, but this is the equation. The problem is that uh, I cannot put what I like uh, this equation just yes, go just one here, but I think that Georgia brush should do that this equation can be applied here, for example. And now because I cannot take this equation some here, so I cannot do nothing. I'm sorry. So but it doesn't matter. You can change the color here. Should just go to the color here. Put this color. Be changing everything, go out. After that, take again, graphic settings, put X axis here, X label. And after that, we take E label here. Okay, go out. So now here you have this equation. So, Okay, but I have a problem. I'd like to have a this label too, X label I would like to have. Okay, if you have a snippet tool, just uh, hit the print screen, take one, uh, one window here, something like this. And according you to your document here, and just put that. Delete this one here. So. So now we have. Okay, so let me show the 
whole exercise. Also, first one we have a if we did the partial uh, fraction. After that, when we have a taken all the constants here, we have a putting down here, and we have, have a found finally the the integrals, which means that uh, gives the primitive function for one divided by uh, power three x plus one power two. And finally, we have a taken the solution. And this equation here gives this graph here. Or if you like to show in one page, there will be something like this. Thank you very, thank you very much, guys. I hope that you like this video. It's a pretty long video. I'm sorry for that. But uh, to be a scientist is not easy. You must try to working in mathematical problem every day if you like to learn. Good luck. Thank you very much. Have a nice time. Go to my YouTube channel and put a comments and like me.